Recording packet tracer will be examining the network address translation, uh, also kind of also called the NAP. Uh, right now we're waiting for the lights that are amber to turn green, and they're green now. And then now I'm going to go into the simulation mode. And then I'm going to go to the PC. I'm going to go to the desktop, web browser. I'm going to type in www.ispserver.com. Okay. And we'll make sure the simulation mode is on. Let me click go. So go. Okay. Now we have two little things here to get the information on them. You just click on the colored part and it pops up the PDU information. We got the outbound. And we also have the the other one. Sometimes they're outbound and inbound. <laughs> now we're gonna go and click on the capture twice to find out customer PC accepted the ARP reply and then builds another packet okay it didn't accept it from the customer router didn't like that one Okay, the ones that answered the ARP request was the customer switch, the customer router, and the www.customerserver.com ARP. And then we we'll click it, click capture forward twice again. And Customer PC accepts the ARP reply and builds another packet. What is the packet protocol for the new packet? Well, let's take a look. This is the new protocol for the new packet and just tells you all the information you need to know on it. I think this is where it's coming from, this is where it's going. Then we have our next step and is they want me to click it twice, capture forward twice again. Is, uh, click the www.customerservers.com server one. Okay, we'll click that one. Now it wants me to click the outborn tab. Okay. Now 
Now it says scroll down to the bottom to see the application layer data. What is the IP address for the ISP server? Okay. The IP address. That would be right here. 209.165.1.1. Okay, now we're going to go into the event, event list window and click capture for twice again. And exit out of this. Click capture for twice. And the customer, seat, customer PC now formulates another ARP request. And then we click uh, this capture again twice. Oh, they want me to click it uh, ten times, it looks like. That was two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. <clears throat> Formula is HTTP request packet. Customer PC finally has enough information to request a page from the IS ISP server. Um, we'll click forward, capture forward three times. Click the packet on the customer router to examine the content. Customer router is a NAP border router what is inside the local address and inside the global address PC okay okay here we go we got our IP addresses here and here and then we need to go on to the next one it says click the the capture forward seven more times two three four five six seven just wants us to see that the the IP's address Dresses have changed and again as the packet is forward to the PC and then it just wants me to do the same thing with the other PC but I don't want to do it it's just the same exact thing just going through the steps over again and I just want you to just show you how the how everything changes for the IP addresses uh, thank you for watching